Hi guys, Orville Edward Walcott here. I want to shoot this very, very quick video uh, just to talk about four very quick tips uh, to succeeding online. Uh, the first is, number one, you've got to have good habits. So all people who build very, very large businesses, they have very, very good habits. Now, I don't like boasting about what I've accomplished online, but trust me on this, um, I'm able with myself and, uh, and for other people to help them routinely have paydays of 1,250, 3,000, 300, 5,000 even $10,000 per sale. Now, I'm deliberately not going to go into too much detail about the company that I'm with because I just want to give you uh, an idea of where I'm coming from and helping people make these sort of uh, commissions all over the world um, and really benefiting myself, of course. But So that's where I'm coming from. I've spoken on the international stage and how lots and lots of people and companies improve. Uh, now, the stage number one, again, the first thing that you want to focus on is, like I said, having really good daily habits. Now, what are some of the habits that people who are successful have online well number one they understand that they've got to commit themselves to certain marketing practices every single day whether they're using YouTube or LinkedIn or Facebook it doesn't matter they have certain actions they take every single day but the number one thing which I do each morning um, is I make sure my mindset is right so what I will do in the morning and in the evening I will spend about five to ten minutes either reading a book or listen to something on YouTube, which is really, really positive and uplifting. And it gets the mindset right because whenever you're doing content marketing, whether it's on YouTube or LinkedIn or Facebook, or whether like myself, you're doing conferences, video conferences or Skype calls to lots of people all over the world, which I do frequently, your mindset has to be right, which it normally is. But people can tell if your mindset is right and it really does come through in all that you do, whether you're blogging, whether you're doing videos as well. Therefore, that's the first thing. Now that leads into the second thing, uh, which is making sure you take daily actions. Now, the key thing is, is this, is you've got to think about who you want to attract into your business. You know, the reality is that leaders and people who are of leadership caliber, they're, they're watching what you're doing. If you're posting on Facebook, if you're using if you're distributing blogs, um, then they want to see that you're doing consistently just exactly what you promised. You know, the key thing of email marketing fundamentally is it is quite simple in terms of, it's simple but not necessarily easy, that once you get people to give their name and email on what's called a lead capture page, you've then got to build a relationship with them. And one of the ways you do that is definitely through quality emails. Now, listen to me very carefully. The emails have to be daily. They absolutely have to be daily. Um, it can't be once or twice a week. It's got to be daily. Now, you might be thinking, what if people get tired of it? They absolutely won't. What they will get tired of, though, is if you do it intermittently, like once or twice a week, uh, they'll just delete your emails. You need to be consistent, and that's very, very important. The third biggest tip I'd give you, and this is really crucial, is in whatever it is you're doing, you need to make sure you're giving value. You know. People have a number of goals, and that is to make sure that whatever it is you're selling online, it's got to meet a need that they have. You know, people want to know what's the simplest, fastest way they can make money online in a way that is ethical and systems that make sense and are productive. Now, whatever it is you're doing, you need to forget about the sort of features of what your product does online, uh, because people really don't care. What they care about are the benefits to them. It's a complete switch. So let's just say, for example, I don't know, you sell sell washing machines online, for example, uh, you might talk about the gadgets and the buttons and you know how fast things spin round. People don't care. What you need to do is frame everything you do, the videos, the blogs, the capture pages, in terms of one thing and one thing alone, and that is the benefits, how much quicker it cleans your clothes, how much easier it makes it happen. And that's what you need to focus on. Because remember, you've got a very, very short time span in order to actually you know, capture people's emotions. And the last thing I want to say to you is this is, and it links into what I've just said with, from value, is make sure that you're actually dealing with problems, that you are solving problems that people have. So the biggest problem people have easily when it comes to any sort of online business is how do I consistently get leads? Now, leads are people who are interested in, or potentially interested anyway, in your product or service. And uh, most people just don't know how to get them, not because 
and of anything other than they simply haven't been shown how to do it. So if you can show people, here's how you get leads, um, here's how you get visitors to your site really, really easily, number one, and in a step-by-step -step way, and I can show you how to do that, I won't go into it now, but you can do it in a very step-by-step -step way. Number two, once they get those leads, here's how you convert them uh, to want to buy from you over and over again. You know, capturing leads is one thing, getting them to buy from you over and over again is another skill altogether. Now, if you don't know that, then you absolutely need mentoring from a quality mentor with a proven system who can show you how to do that, and that person is myself. But, more on that another time, what you need to do though is show people step by step, that can be video, that can be, I definitely recommend uh, doing um, Google Hangouts or using something like Screen-O-Matic, whereby you can, I think you can download a free version of Screen-O-Matic, whereby you can actually take video snapshots of step by step what you're doing. People need to be able to see that what you're doing and your processes are simple and easy to follow. Why? Because what people care about are their goals, their needs, their strengths. So lead with value. You. Um, and more importantly, you've heard these four tips, but the main thing is to follow them and make it a daily, daily um, habit that you do all the time. Uh, please, I guarantee, if your focus is just on making money and you don't care about leading the value, and you're certainly not positioning yourself to solve people's problems, people sense it and they will not join your list and you will not make any money. The best way to approach your business is what I call a servant leader mindset genuinely have in your heart of hearts to want to serve people and bring value to them and solve their problems and make it a habit. So to your success. Bye-bye.